Hi there! So in this video, I am going to discuss the aspects of communication. Communication is divided into two major aspects, verbal or linguistic aspect and nonverbal or extralinguistic aspect. Verbal or linguistic aspect includes formal or informal, oral or written, which includes use of codes and words. Nonverbal or extralinguistic aspect, on the other hand, may improve or change a linguistic code and it does not make use of words. It is also divided into these elements. The first element is proxemics. It refers to the language of space. It has two components. The first component is the distance, which refers to the separation between the speaker and the audience. The second component is the physical arrangement, which refers to the layout of the venue where communication takes place. The second element is kinesics. It refers to the language of the body. It has five components. The first component is facial expressions. This refers to the movement of the facial muscles, which carry the emotive purpose of the speaker. The second component is eye contact, which shows the sincerity of the speaker towards his audience. The third component is the posture, which shows the index of attitude of the speaker during speech delivery. The fourth component is the movement, which is the shifting of position from one place to another. And the last component is the gestures, which refers to the purposeful movement of the body. The third element is haptics, which refers to the language of touch. The next element is chronemics, which refers to the language of time. Next, we have the artifactual, which refers to the language of objects. Then we have olfactics, which refers to the language of smell. Then we also have oculistics, which refers to the physical appearance of a person. And those are the aspects of communication. Thank you for watching.